What's up guys, just finished day two of Drift Week. It was an amazing time. We're here at Villain Sportsland in Walla Walla, Washington. It's a super small town, but it was awesome because the whole town came out to support us, came out to do ride-alongs, drift with us. I had an amazing day doing a lot of tandems with Matt Field and Chelsea Genova. Definitely learn a lot as well. It's a tight little track, but it's fun. We did have some problems with the car though. The lower control arm bolts kept coming out, so the boys were nice enough to help me drill it and get it all set yesterday. We also ran into a lot of issues with the brake line. So we had to fab up new brake lines. It's crazy because the stuff that I've never dealt with braking has been braking at Drift Week. But tomorrow, the next day and a half, we have some chill time. We're gonna drive tomorrow to the next venue and then uh, start some drifting again another day and a half. So in the meantime, we're gonna hang out, fix the cars, wash the cars, get oil changes, make sure everything's running well and get started for the next round. Day two of Drift Week, got back to the house to drop off the race car. Super lucky because we have Eddie here now and he brought the truck. It's funny driving this right now and it's got tons and tons of air in the airbags, so it's really stiff, but it feels like a Bentley compared to being in a race car for just three days. I can't imagine two weeks of it. We're gonna get some groceries, we're gonna grill and chill tonight, get rested up because after the next day and a half of chill time and drive time, we're gonna have a lot and a lot of drifting. So uh, in the meantime, everyone's trying to get oil changes tomorrow, wash their cars, rest ourselves, and fix all the stuff that we've broken. It's a travel day as well, so I think we've got about four and a half hours of driving uh, at normal people speed. So maybe we'll make it in like two and a half, who knows? But stay tuned, it's gonna be fun. Morning. All right, day three, I think, or maybe day four of Drift Week. Just left Walla Walla. We're headed all the way to Monroe, Washington, about 300 miles. Pretty much highway driving, though. Got the rest of the pack back. All in all, been a great time. Billings was freaking awesome. A lot of people tapped the wall and or crashed your cars into the wall, but I almost hit the wall, but I didn't. I drifted out of it. Other than that, freaking rad so far. I can tell you this, I'm gonna be going to drift drink every single year. Assuming it goes on every year, I'm always gonna have a spot. It's hanging with the boys, it's a vacation, and there's tons and tons of drifting and shredding tires, which is awesome. And obviously I'm learning a lot, given the amazing drivers I'm surrounded with. Three tickets. 
minutes already. Appreciate you. Oh yeah, Jimmy Jones to the rescue. Looks like they just opened. You got a subway right there. I love it. Matt's laughing because he hates subway. Few inches later. Good stop. Oh, and that guy had no meat on his sandwich. Huh. It was still good, I'm sure. Frank's house. I'm not sure who Frank is, but he's obviously a really nice guy and respected in the drift community because he's inviting all of us over to his house. Thank you, Frank. Thank you, Frank. And apparently there's going to be some food. We get another sleep in and work day tomorrow because the track goes hot at, I think, 3 p.m. So, straight. Sorry, wrong turn. Can't jump the curb either. I can't. I just screwed up, guys. Sorry to Matt and Debrino. I just got us going the wrong way. Don't vlog and drive, kids. I'm a trained professional. 